Hello, Max here. Uh, you may remember me from such classics as Wool, Laser Maze and Fancy Man. Uh, today I'm going to be making a human remote. I've got my essentials, cardboard, scissors, tape, glue and a handful of bits and pieces. Uh, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to use or how at this point, but that's just how I like to make things. I either start with an idea and then figure out how to make it happen, or I'll find an interesting object and that will give me an idea. Either way, the making part is almost as much fun as the playing part. I just get some materials together, try not to put too much pressure on myself, and just see what happens. Uh, so I came up with the idea for this when I was thinking about a particular young person I work with. When he plays and interacts with you, the thing he seems to be really drawn to and excited by is cause and effect. So through his play he explores things like, if I do this, what happens? What can I do to change the environment? If I do this, what will you do, etc. And sort of one way to create play opportunities around that is to give someone more variables, more things to be able to have an impact on. So I thought, how about a remote for another person? How would that work? What would you have to negotiate? How would you get someone to play along? Uh, how could you surprise each other? Who plays what role? Now, my remote has gotten a bit fancy here because I got a bit carried away, but yours could be very simple. Uh, it could even just be a drawing or some bottle top stuck on top of a cereal box, or it could be more complicated than mine. What it looks like or how it works only a small bit of the fun. Something like this only comes alive when you play with it. So let's test it out. Um, my twin brother's going to help me out here. He's a, a hotshot lawyer from the big city, which is why he's wearing cravat and sunglasses. Oh, here we go. Okay, let's try the eye opener. Operated by a repurposed Hot Wheels car. Combat panel. That's a, a twiddle for each each limb there. Here we go. Hmm. Yeah, he's not much of a fighter uh, or, or smiler. But jump and fall. Much more fun. Uh, and again. <laughs> okay, loading up the spin function. <sighs> Go. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm Speedometer now. Cranking it up slowly. Starting with a walk. In the pace and oh. excellent stuff. Dance onometer again, start slowly, start of a, a shuffle, slowly turn it up. Here we go. He can fight, but can he dance? Absolutely. Hmm, so that was my human remote video. What do you think? Does it give you any ideas? What kind of remote might you make? Don't forget to clean up. 